<laughs> we hail him, you know, the king of all produce, too. All right, so we're talking squash. So is squash a vegetable or fruit? Well, that's a very good question. I like that. And you like how I turned the tables by asking you the I question? was just about ready to ask you a question to make you well, sound okay. really smart. <laughs> well, I was thinking because it's seeds, it theoretically could be considered a fruit, but for chef purposes, it's considered a vegetable. Okay, well, let's take a look. First of all, uh, let's take a look at pumpkin. Is the pumpkin a fruit or, or, or a vegetable? I mean, I would... I, I, I would... What would you call it? I would think it was a vegetable. Oh, very good. See, it is part of the hard winter squash family. Okay. Which are which are vegetables. Okay. Uh, fruits have seeds. These right. have seeds. Right. Fruits also ripen. Okay. They get sweeter. The, these so don't. These just get bigger. Oh. Right? They just get bigger so that because they don't get sweet, it's That's not it. necessarily That's it. classified. So, ladies and gentlemen, Melissa, yes. Autumn has a new... Favorite, really? yes, yeah, squash, and what I don't, I don't mean the game squash. <laughs> oh, by the way, do we have? Do you think we, we have a smart audience, don't we? Of course we do. So, you at uh, home? so English, Nod your head, yes. English teachers out there, if you have one peach, it's a peach. If you have two peach, peaches, it's a peaches. Okay. Uh, right, one tomato, two tomatoes, one squash, two squash. Is it squashes? Come on. I thought you were tricking me. No. Is it so, squashes? I don't know. I want an English teacher to tell oh, me. I don't okay. know. Okay, email us. Good day. Okay. Kmaxtv.com. I mean, I would think it. So, would first be... of all, where did it get I the name squash? I got a couple squash? of squashes. Where did it get the name squash? Uh, the Algonquin Indians. You got to smash it? I don't know. No, the Algonquin Indians of okay. New England. When the pilgrims arrived, they said, hey, what is all this stuff out there that you're growing? A scoot, a squash, they called it. <laughs> Thank goodness the pilgrims cut that name down to squash. squash. I, I would not want to say, hey, what? A scoot, a squash. So there are so many different varieties. This is the variety. Uh, you know, back in the early 1900s, you know the pumpkin pie filling cans? Right, 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 yep. Guess what they were filled with? Squ uh, this, banana squash. This is called this a is banana squash. This is called banana squash. In fact, these usually come much larger. I used to get these when I first started in the produce industry. They'd be as tall as me. They were so heavy. I had to get out the biggest knife that I had to even deal with them. No, how did this compare? How would a knife like that size compare? Well, that knife would do really good with one, yep. yeah, with one of these. So anyway, so many different varieties. So first of all, in the next hour, I'm going to show you, first of all, a, a brand new variety. Oh. A brand new variety. Variety. And I'm going to show you how to get into the yeah, hard winter really, squash. Sometimes it's, it's very difficult. I'm not going to lie. I'll, I'll, I get it pre sliced sometimes uh -huh. just because yes. it's easier. Please, English it. teachers, squash or squashes? Oh, squashes. Uh, squashes. I've looked oh, it up. We already have? On the Merriam Webster Dictionary, plural for squash is squashes or squash. <laughs> oh, <laughs> we're both right. right. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah. All right, go. The one time. We'll, we'll be right. He's always right. It's the great thing about the English language. You can always contradict <laughs> it constantly. I say it's a gaggle.